This is Diane Sawyer and her husband Tom Sawyer. And I'm not making up those names, those are their real names. I'm near the end of Joe Canyon's trail, sitting taking a break, and I hear a woodpecker. I've got three cows hiking with me on the Arizona Trail. Oh, they're running now. Well, it is four o'clock, and I just finished Passage One, Wachuca Mountains, and now begins Passage Two, Kinolo Hills East. I started Passage One yesterday at 8.30 in the morning. Here's Parker Lake. It's only a mile from here, but I'm not going to go there. I'm going to go about two miles up where Parker Lake Creek drains from the lake and camp there because there are some beautiful campsites right next to the creek. This is a beautiful trail here. And over there, just behind the trees, you can see Parker Lake. I am at mile 26.3 and this view is just stunning. This is Diane Sawyer and her husband Tom Sawyer. And I'm not making up those names, those are their real names. And they're from New Hampshire and they're doing a section hike in this trail right now. They're, and I just met them and they're very nice people. 
and everybody should be doing this, right? Hiking? Exactly. Okay. <laughs> nice meeting you. Nice meeting you. Likewise. In the low hills. I just hiked through all of that and I'm cutting out of them. I made it to the Canelo Pass trailhead at 5.30. Finished passage 2. I'm camping right at the start of passage 3. And then tomorrow I will finish passage 3 and be in Patagonia in the evening. And over there, that's where I'm camping. There's my backpack. I started the third passage at 7.45 this morning. And it is 16.4 miles to Patagonia, which I am going to do today. Tonight I will sleep in a real bed, take a shower, eat some good food, and do laundry. On passage 3, Canelo Pass, going to Patagonia, and this view is simply marvelous. This is the Down Under Tank, a water source for AZT hikers and for the cows, which are all around here, as you can see. Here's a dam with running water. I don't know where it's coming from. It sounds pretty really nice. This is Red Rock Well. I just got a couple of liters of water here. And this is the most reliable source for the next 10 miles. So I'm carrying three liters, three and a half liters actually. Hope that'll get me all the way to Patagonia. I am seven miles from Patagonia and I found this little creek and a great place to cool off and also got a liter of water. 
because there's no other water source for the next seven miles.